over here tonight, a very, very funny man, ladies and gentlemen, Sean Walton. How's it going, guys? <laughs> my name is Sean, and um, the NFL has ruined my name. Apparently, there's a uh, no Sean, Lo Sean, De Sean, Ro Sean. <laughs> there's no actual Sean's left. <laughs> Used to be a popular name. Who knows, right? Um, I watch a lot of TV. Have you seen this commercial for the pregnancy tests, where the woman's really serious? She's like. Imagine knowing you're pregnant the moment it happens. I'm like, you thought it was hard to get us to cuddle before. Like, now we're at the door. Um, I cleaned the bathroom the other day. I cleaned the bathroom. Not the guy cleaning. Guy cleaning is when you miss the toilet, but you're happy you're wearing a sock. And they're like, done, done. No, no, I actually cleaned the bathroom. I got under the vanity, I sorted everything out. So apparently the girlfriend doesn't throw out old tampon boxes. She just accumulates boxes. So I'm like, no big deal. I clean them up, I broke them down, I put them in the recycling bin. The next day I hear that sound, you know the sound of the garbage truck pulling up when you didn't put out the bins? So I do the dash, I run upstairs, I grab the bin, I run outside, I hand it to the garbage truck guy. I hand him the bin, all he sees is like 10 tampon boxes on the top. And I hand him the bin, he looks at the bin, he looks at me, he looks at the bin. And he doesn't say it, but I can see it in his eyes. He's like, you poor fucking bastard. <laughs> anyway, we're not together anymore. She bleeds too much. Um, I've been single for a while now, a little too long, I think. I've been watching Intervention differently. I'm kind of like, hey, what's she on? Ooh, painkillers, that's not so bad. <laughs> She's kind of cute, what's she, oh, oh, Matt. Is she past the Fergie point? <laughs> That's the point of no return. <laughs> uh, I'm getting older now. I know I'm getting older because uh, I get birth uh, I get blowjobs on my birthday now, and that's uh, three years. Not three years, you know, right? I'm like my birthday. I know it's coming. I'm like that's that's how that's how you know. But a girl lied to me once. She said if you act confident, you say what you want, you can get it whenever you want. So I was, I'm like, I know, so you're already laughing, you know it's a lie. You probably told him the same thing. Sad confident, yeah, so I was like, we're going, you're making out, and I was like, oh yeah, and I'm like, I hope it doesn't look like this, because then I know why it didn't work. I'm like, and then she's like, would you stop? I'm like, well, you know, I'm acting confident. She's like, well, let me finish my quarter chicken dinner, everybody's staring at us. <laughs> I knew it wasn't true. I like camping. I think I might go camping this weekend. You like camping? You like camping? Girls like camping? You see, yeah, well, I know you. <laughs> Girls don't like camping as much as guys. Guys love camping. You know why? We get to pee on everything. <laughs> there's a tree. There's a fire. There's the first guy to fall asleep. <laughs> He knows who he went camping with. What do the girls get to do? They get to go in the woods and find a good spot. They get to go in the woods, they get to find a good spot. They wander in the woods and they go and they come back and then they tell each other about it. They go, I found a spot, it's in there. It's two trees to the right, I left you some toilet paper. Not anymore. We made a breakthrough in science. There's a product out there called the Shiwi. And what the Shiwi is, it's like a, it's like a funnel for the ladies, but it aims outward, so you can like, what you do is you hold, I gotta have to do visuals here. You hold it against your area, and it shoots out the urine that way. So you can pee standing up wherever you want. And as amazing as this product is, they have accessories. They have a cozy in case you get cold. They have an extension kit in case you're in a contest. They have, and they have a little pair of boxers so you can like put them in it so you don't have to do no hands. But I had some questions about the product and my first question was probably yours too. It is dishwasher safe. All right, I'll finish with this one guys. Sometimes I drink a bit and then I think I can sing. 
And I, I, I sound like, a, like I, I'm horrible. I can't sing. But sometimes I'll sing karaoke because, you know, you get into that mood. But there's some songs that bother me. There's a song by Carrie Underwood. It's called Jesus Take the Wheel. Well, it's a horrible song anyway, but would you let Jesus drive your car? I don't know. He's a smart guy. He'd probably get his license. But what kind of driver would Jesus be? Would he be courteous and let everybody in? Or would he be reckless because he knows he can resurrect? You see Jesus on the news, arrested again in another street racing incident. He's doing the perp walk. Jesus in the perp walk. Going, oh man, my dad's going to kill me again. <laughs> well, that's it for me, guys. I'm going to bring up the host again.